Hello everybody, my name is Burnett Williams and I'm about to show you how to make some awesome movie style trailers. They look just like something you would see inside the movie theaters and you can use these little short videos which are anywhere between 30 seconds to one minute long. You can use these short videos to advertise and promote your website, your services, or your skills or whatever you do. And these videos, they're awesome. And once you learn how to do it, you're going to be very proud of yourself. <laughs> Just take a couple of minutes or so to look at some of the video samples that I have attached to this video following this message. I'm also using the free version of iMovie. You can download it to your cell phone for free. several more video samples for you to watch and every last one of these videos these little short movie movie style trailers was created using a program that I use that's called iMovie iMovie and it is an Apple based program that you can actually download to your cell phone Believe it or not, every last one of these trailers was made using my iPhone that I have in my hand now that I, I am recording this video on. Yes, I'm using a simple iPhone. <laughs> Thank you.
short video clip. Then after that, we'll go ahead and get started. We're gonna start with step number one. In step number one, basically all we're going to do is go online to apple.com and then in the search the search bar on Apple, just type in iMovie, the letter I, movie, M-O-V-I-E. From there, you will be able to see the iMovie link and it, it shows um, up in the form of a white star with a blue or dark blue purple, purplish background and basically all you're going to do is download, download that app onto your cell phone. It is a free app. Right after you download the iMovie app onto your cell phone, just hit the thumbnail of the star that's on your cell phone, on the desktop of your cell phone. Just hit that little star to open up the iMovie program. Now we're going to step number two. Step number two. Again, the iMovie app that I use is the free app version. And right after you open up the iMovie app on your cell phone, you will be able to see several movie templates. Several movie templates. And you just choose any one of them to start with. Just choose one. Just hit one of those um, templates to open it up should notice a plus sign. You may have to hit that to actually open up the trailers. Another screen will pop up and it gives you the option of either making a movie or a trailer. The movie um, template is at the, the top. The trailers is down at the bottom and everything that you've seen so far um, in this video has been, been made using the trailer template. So just hit on the trailer template. <laughs> Step number three, basically what you need to do is go ahead and get the pic pictures, the photos, or video, a little short video clips. Um, and some of these videos that you've seen here in my sample, um, you've seen me using a lot of pictures. Also, you can import short video clips that you can take using your cell phone, your iPhone. Go ahead and get all that information together. If you don't have any pictures or video available, what you can do is go online, go onto Google, and then just type in uh, whatever type of picture you're looking for or that you have in mind. I mean, prime example would be um, just type in car or Ford or horse or whatever, horse, chickens, or ducks, whatever. Just type that in the search browser in Google. And then instead of clicking on the web search, at the, at the top of the screen, click on the image search, image search. One thing about the trailer mode is that um, the audio is already there. Um, there is audio clips that's already assigned to those trailers and you don't have to worry about importing music to go with that. But in the movie format, you will have to import music and whatever songs you want to use in it, it's your choice. Just import it in. Also, make sure that whatever music or photos or video that you download from the internet to use in your trailers, make sure they are royalty free there, and there is no copyright infringement on that because you can get into a lot of trouble using copyrighted images. 
in step number five, I'm going to give you some close-up video footage where you can see exactly what I'm doing. Okay, what I'm about to do is show you step by step how I do this. And basically, once you download the app onto your iPhone, it will look like this with the star. You just match the thumbnail of the star. And basically what you want to do is go down to the bottom right hand corner, hit the plus button. And once you hit the plus button, you're going to have the option of either making a movie just by hitting the top one or a trailer. And most of the time, um, my customers have me to make trailers. So basically what I do is you just hit the word trailer, hit the trailer, trailer button. And then these are the templates that, that show up. And you just choose any one that you want to use. And one of my favorite ones that I love to use is the first one here which is called adrenaline so once I hit that it shows up up here and you want to go to the top right corner and hit the word create trailer so once you hit the word create trailer basically what it's going to do is um, so you the outline and the storyboard all this information here so far as the outline is concerned it allows you to change the name of the video from adrenaline or off-road it allows you to change the name to whatever title you want to give it and for the time being you don't have to even worry about that um, just but whenever you are, are ready to change that all you basically have to do is click on it. once you click on that you can just backspace and it's kind of hard to do this while I'm videoing but you know I just hit the backspace and then type in whatever you want to and I'm just going to type in movie and then you go down to your next line whatever um, just go through all of this and change the name to whatever you want to change it to and what it shows up here um, the name of the movie is movie I just gave it a name movie and the studio name you can give that whatever name you want to give it and just but just take a little time to play around with it all this stuff can be changed around and put whatever information you want in it just by clicking on it and backspacing and then retyping your words in and once you've done that go down to the bottom once you Type in all the, the text you want in, just hit done. Okay, I am recording. And this is a rough, um, I mean, this, this is not professional here, but I'm just trying to give you an example of what you can do with this, how you can get your video footage in. And this 